Do you remember this? Justin Bieber, this is how he eats a burrito. Yeah. You guys, is it too late to say sorry for eating a burrito like Never. a total weirdo? <laughs> Take a look at this picture. Does he know how burritos work? That's actually how we eat burritos in Canada. Okay. No, we start in the middle. Oh my gosh. Then you get two halves. Obviously, halves. social media is just exploding. This is a messy situation waiting to happen. And it is yes. a disgrace. <laughs> it's designed to be eaten like this. Here, I wanted to know how you guys felt about Bieber eating a burrito like this. Oh my god. A writer from Vice tried to eat that way and documented it and basically said it was like just a disaster. Yeah, he's about. eating a burrito like he's eating corn on the cob or playing harmonica. You probably know this already, but this stunt was pulled off by these legends. Gotcha. Yes theory. Now I've received so many DMs from you guys asking me, Connor, how did you end up involved in this operation and how do I go viral on the internet? Well watch this video to find out. The goal for the Bieber video was to get a bunch of views on the video or preferably get a news outlet to cover it. We were immediately hit by a slow start. Well, um, we're at four comments on Reddit in 22 minutes. Damn, this is going to be harder than I thought. Now, if you happen to stop by your friend's house and they're in the middle of trying to fool the entire internet and they ask you if you want to help, the obvious answer is, hell yeah, let's do this. Okay, our friend Connor just joined the operation to try to make this go viral. I think that you need to put it onto a different subreddit. Now, it just so happens that I have some past experience at trying to make stupid things go viral, which is exactly what we were trying to do here. Perfect for mildly infuriating. Dude, nothing's working for now, but hopefully it'll get picked up. Now there are a lot of different factors that go into making something go viral on Reddit. And it's a case by case basis, but the most important factor in my opinion is choosing the right subreddit for the kind of content you're trying to get to go viral. If you choose the wrong subreddit, it will not work. Now in this case, there's a subreddit for things that mildly infuriate you, which is perfect. Connor! Dude, it's freaking number one! <laughs> yes, yes it's go. working! Holy sh! 2000! <laughs> Three thousand. Ten point six. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. One hundred eighty-four notifications. I just downloaded the, the app like an hour ago. How long do you think till like news sources will pick that up? I have no idea. Well, as it turned out, not very long at all. <laughs> okay, so it's starting to go completely viral. It's getting kind of crazy. Like it's getting picked up by Vice, Esquire, E! News just maybe picked it up. And places like that are starting to wonder if it's all a conspiracy theory, if it's a hoax. There's, they, they have all these people who are so into Justin Bieber. They've gone out and they've like noti noticed that, you know, his the, the hair on his kneecaps isn't the right kind of hair that he normally has. Both sides are just blindly putting it out there. They're not even questioning it. It's just going completely viral. Let's see where this goes. And that's when things really started to take off. This is getting crazy. I just got messaged by a woman from Vanity Fair. She wants to write an article. I'm gonna to go to talk to the guys and I'm gonna see what we're gonna respond because this is kind of crazy. This is a little bit freaking me out now. Connor called me. Vanity Fair contacted him and asked him where he got the photo because they want to do a story on it. Now I'll be honest, I was a little bit nervous about this because I had crossed my mind that there's probably some law out there about blatantly lying to the media. Who knows? But you know what? It seemed like way too much fun to pass up so I just said screw it. I went back and forth with a few messages with the woman from Vanity Fair. So she asked me like where and when it was taken, what was the name of the park, like what was happening, how do you know it's Justin Bieber? She's asking all these questions. It's actually got my name in it. I don't know why I put my name in it. I've officially been interviewed for Vanity Fair. <laughs> my first and last interview for Vanity Fair by the looks of it. Okay, so it's official. We are in Vanity Fair. Check out this bad boy. The burrito eating strategy that divided a nation. Little did I know that this was only the beginning of the interviews. He's getting DMs on Reddit from like news sites, radio shows, for interviews. Now I had no idea what to say in these interviews, so I decided to just wing it and see how far I could push it and what kind of ridiculous stuff I could get away with saying. Just gotta be able to bullshit the questions. They call him. Hey, hey Erica, it's Connor. Let's start from the beginning. What day did you take the photo? Where were you and what were you doing? Last week, I think it was last Friday. It was last week, I think it was last Friday. Uh, I was just hanging out in West Hollywood Park. Me and my friends were hanging out in that park. I'm trying to learn to do photography and like videography and stuff. So I had my camera with me and we were just hanging out. We, I actually took the photo. I saw Justin from a distance and he just quickly took a photo. Like we thought it at first it was Bieber. When we saw he was uh, he was eating his burrito, but you can absolutely tell it was Justin in person. So like we very quickly realized. So we started to take a photo and then we saw he was going in for this this bite on this burrito in a what has turned out to be a crazy way. I was just putting it on Reddit for fun. Who would have ever thought it would go so crazy? So what do you say to everyone trying to prove it's not Bieber? People online think that this is a setup. What do you say to that? 
that would be crazy. I don't, I don't know even know why people would think that. Like the whole thing would have to be orchestrated or something. I don't even know. Like that's crazy. A, a lot of people are questioning whether it was Justin Bieber. It was definitely, it definitely was him. I think the internet has spoken on that. Cheers, thanks. <laughs> Dude, what's happening? What's happening? What is happening right now? Dude, they're calling him famous. They're like, you're famous now. Go enjoy your fame. He asked several times, like, everyone's saying it's fake, it's not his hair. I was like, eh, look, you have to be there. <laughs> <laughs> look at the way he's eating the burrito straight to the middle. I ask you, who eats a burrito? like this. Chrissy Teigen seems to like the idea. Okay, well, we also got hold of Connor Brown, the guy that took the photo. And despite Madeline's argument, he's insisting in the fact that that is Biebs with the burrito. It was absolutely, I don't know, but it was definitely Justin. I'm not the biggest Bieber, Bieber fan in the world, but my friend is. And uh, he was, he knew instantly. He was, saw the clothes. He just saw the way Everything about him was, it, he thought it was Justin. I feel like if someone was going to pretend to be, to do a Bieber picture or something, like why would they pick a burrito? It is <laughs> the real Bieber, I am convinced. So the moral of this story is that if your friends ask you to jump on board a crazy idea, always say yes. If you guys would like me to do more videos about how to go viral or how to get things in the news, then do two things. One, like this video, because that actually gives me a good idea of if you like this kind of content or not. And two, comment down below and let me know what kind of videos you'd like to see because I can make videos about some of the past projects I got in the news and make go viral or we could take on some new projects and we could try and make them go viral together and I could take you along for the journey. So let me know down in the comments. I'm looking forward to hearing your thoughts. Hey!